mean, I feel like uh, the coaches and, and the players uh, had confidence in me coming in, and um, they have watched me play and stuff. And it was a matter of like trying to like blend in with the team, and the guys are really nice. So it was a matter of being confident and like comfortable. And I think um, they provided that for me and made it easy for me to um, just join the squad normally. Yeah. The uh, low key played a really good ball over the top, and I used my speed in that. And yeah. Golf I'm feeling much, much better now, and uh, um, the longer I play, the better, the better it gets, you know. Because the match fitness, you, you cannot, you cannot replicate it unless you play games. So, the more I'm on the field, the better I'm feeling. And uh, today is, I mean, the weather is a little bit changing now. There was a little breeze, so <clears throat> I felt more fresh and uh, and more mobile. I'm getting accustomed to it. So, I haven't played in, in a heat like this like for five, six years when I was playing back home. And uh, but I mean it's a massive win for us, three points a day, and especially the second uh, the second win at home. We have we have to focus now. I try to give my hundred percent every time I step on the field, and uh, every time the coach have, has faith in me to do a job, I try to do it. And uh, I mean I believe everybody is important, and but this is a team that that plays more my game, so. I have more chances to to kind of show what I can do uh, because you know w kind of alone you cannot do miracles. But for example, when the whole team moves, you create chances, and this is why I love this team going forward because we move a lot and and we create chances. So I'm hoping I'm hoping to start making a difference. But in order for me to do that, I am I have to. Add, um, I have to adjust myself first to be able to help others. So I have to get on top of my game again um, by playing more and more, and then I will. I can. I can help others, kind of, like it happens today. But I'm. I'm very happy with uh, with the two assists and the win, of course. But my job is to score goals, so I have to fix that now, and uh, I need to start getting on the score sheet because uh, that's my job. I'm a striker. We didn't have a lot of time to have a look at Lucky to get him involved with the, the rest of the team in terms of team play and pattern of play but um, what we saw from the little bit that we did have on Friday was he moves well without the ball he's a typical striker he doesn't want to be a midfielder he wants to play up front he wants to try to run behind defences and he wants to score goals and it was evident at the end there the run he made to, to get to the ball first and foremost was tremendous then the composure that he showed to stand the defender up and then to take the defender on and drive into the box before putting in the cross come shot. Um, and I'm delighted for him to make that kind of impact and also for the team because it's that little bit of luck that we haven't had in recent times. And it's nice to be on the right end of some luck, uh, particularly at home. And what Etienne does bring is he can allow us to, to have some form of control of the ball higher up the field. We were allowed then to Pete players to join him. He's very good with his back to goal. He's very good at receiving it, protecting it, bringing people into the game, or facing up, taking defenders on, playing with. So his, you see his um, relationship with Georgie developing. They've only had possibly you know, 25 minutes, 30 minutes in Atlanta, and then today again, but they looked as if they've been playing together for a long, long time. But I always say, right, it's not about the coach and the coaching, it's good players. Players, good players can play with good players. And I have, I'm fortunate at the moment that I have the likes of Etienne and, and Georgie and Evans and Lucky now and, and Luke. All those guys are good players and Carl. So I'm hoping that if everyone stays fit, we can be a force for the remainder of the season offensively.